Today we're at the John Monash Science School on the grounds of Monash University. This senior secondary school is devoted to the pursuit of excellence in science, mathematics and associated technologies. Quite unique in secondary education in Victoria. The school's innovative curriculum is co-written with Monash University academics and informed by the latest research in the sciences as well as in the learning and the teaching. This means that the university staff can bring the cutting edge of scientific knowledge and research into the classroom and students can access the first class research laboratories and teaching facilities at the university. In year 10, all students still have to study English and mathematics. They do issue studies, creative studies, languages other than English, as well as personal learning and wellbeing, which also includes PE. They also get to select four amazing elective units that are not what you'd normally find on your school timetable. Students can select from things like bioinformatics, marine biology, cell systems, nanoscience, and much, much more. Hello, my name is Mark McTeer. I'm leading teacher, head of science at John Monash Science School. The kinds of electives we offer here at year 10 are pharmaceutical science, marine biology, quarks to quasars, nanotechnology, but there's a huge range that we offer and all students have the options of choosing any of those subjects uh, as well as core science at year 10. We offer these electives uh, to our students because they're an area of interest to those students. Uh, they're able to choose one elective per semester and some may even do them in year 11 or year 12 as well. Um, the students have a real passion in those areas and they're able to choose from that large range of electives uh, and they're also at the cutting edge of science where we work with Monash University to develop those electives and the students will uh, really see that these subjects are relevant and interesting for them. We find the teachers to teach these subjects uh, by advertising them statewide through the processes we need to, recruitment online, and the student, the teachers that apply have uh, specialties in chemistry or physics or biology or psychology, but when it comes to those electives, uh, some teachers we might find would actually have a real specialty in nanotechnology or marine biology, but in other areas we've trained up those teachers and we work with Monash University to uh, develop the curriculum and to train the teachers in those areas. Monash University is involved with the students here uh, in a large number of ways. Uh, in the, the background and, and leading up to subjects we will plan with those academics and they will, uh, but during the class time they actually come over here and they will uh, run presentations or seminars they, and we'll also take students to Monash University to uh, do experiments. For example in our VCE subjects we will take students there to do some of the school assessed coursework. Um, and Monash University, it's just a fantastic partnership we have with them that they're so involved with the writing of the course and even with the delivering of the course as well. We do a large amount of prac work. In fact, we try and do one experiment per week or more and a range of demonstrations. With the squid dissection, for example, the students will be learning about the anatomy and physiology of the squid uh, how the internal organs work and look at the external structures as well and adaptations they have um, in relation to their survival. Uh, with the last, in fact when we did the uh, dissections in marine biology last year we didn't use the squid, we used the bull shark and that's where we had the academics from Monash University come and uh, run the program for us and they provide us with the bull sharks and uh, actually did, did dissections with our students. In overseeing all the science programs here at John Monash Science School, it's an absolute joy and a pleasure to see the students learning and enjoying and being so engaged with the hands-on approach we have with science here.